Yo, what is good, guys? Welcome back to the channel. All right, well, I don't have any bangers for you today, but uh, I got a little update. Uh, we are going to be heading into the 4th of July weekend, and uh, uh, don't really have much plans, just trying to save some money. I got some uh, bills that are going to be coming up here soon that I need to, <clears throat> to fucking take care of, so I'm just kind of saving up for that, so I'm just going to lay low uh, this holiday, and uh, I'm going to try to get the rover going. Um, get my disco going I've been fucking I put it on the back burner for uh, God now going on a month or so just got really busy with uh, uh, with work and shit so I've been trying to keep up uh, with that so now that I got a little bit of free time um, I want to get this uh, bed platform finally handled I got all the material cut all the body panels for it so now I just gotta uh, paint it and put together um, I got it I'm stuck between um, a couple little things on it like uh, the drawer I'm having a problems with the drawer not lining up right so I got to figure something out with that um, the, the shit has been sitting outside for a while so I gotta clean all the the surface rust out of it uh, right now it's 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 in the disco um, but the, uh, the battery died on it when we transferred it from one disco to another uh, so I took it in to go get charged and it wouldn't hold the charge so I had to warranty I had to warranty the, <coughs> the Odyssey battery so I got a new one put it in uh, works good and then uh, I got to replace the front drive shaft or one of the drive shafts because it's making some funky ass noise. And the rear bushings are blown out since we uh, transferred the lift. Uh, that's when we uh, noticed that they were shot out. So, so now I got to get <coughs> some new ones, but <coughs> there isn't really any factory bushings out that I, I want to use. So. I'm probably going to be forced to go poly, but everybody knows the the horror when it comes to using poly bushings. They squeak, or they're too hard enough, or they just uh, break, and uh, yeah. So normally you want to use factory bushings on, uh, on Land Rover. Uh, on Land Rover parts, the, the factory ones have been working great. Car came out in 03. We're in 2021, so it's 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 lasted thus far. So I uh, would like to go with factory, but as you know, uh, due to the times, uh, we can't get parts. So I'm probably going to be forced to go in with uh, poly bushings, which is not what I want, but at least it'll get me uh, going. Um, so I think the mission for today is to try to unlock this rover because the battery died in it the key doesn't work on the door so i can't unlock it so right now i gotta uh somehow jump it uh running a jumper cable underneath to the starter getting it power and then uh, hopefully that'll give me enough juice to unlock it with the uh, key fob so uh yeah so come along let's let's see how far we get today especially it being hot i still have work to do but i'm just gonna put that on hold and do it a little bit later. I kind of want to get this going. Just kind of get my mind off of shit. So, uh, yeah, we got to run over to McFaddendale. Uh, I need to extend a gas line. I don't know how I am going to do that, but uh, we are going to, we are definitely going to try to do that. So, yeah, come along for the ride. Let's see, let's see how it goes. To it. So right now I gotta <clears throat> try to get this vehicle unlocked. So I need to get. Um, well, let's see. Fuck it. I got a spare battery over here. Oh, good. Let's 
Gotta find some cables. Are you sure that's what you need? Yeah. Right here. That's all I want. Everything has a purpose. Alright, so the goal is to attach it to the a starter. Piece of metal. Probably not that crazy of a piece, but maybe this size right here. Watch this. Watch this, boys. Damn it, man. All this shit rusting. Alright. Let's get ourselves a piece of cardboard. Good job, you fucking ran on the only piece we have out here. Damn it. Alright. Shitty ass throw. Alright, look at what we got. Alright, so there's the starter. So what I want to do is... I'm going to ground the ground wire to the frame. And then... I'm gonna hit the starter wire with the positive on this battery right here. Right here, man. And then with my keys, I'm gonna hit the fucking unlock and then we're gonna unlock it. So, that out of the way. This is the place first. Here me out. Here me out. Clear. Fuck yeah, I got it. I got it unlocked. All right. See what we did there? We grounded. We grounded the chassis to the battery, and then uh, on the positive terminal of the starter, we clamped it down on there, and then we just tapped it over here to give it power, and then that's it. We are dialed in. So now I'm gonna take this battery to get charged. And now this one, hopefully it's not dead. Hopefully we don't have to warranty it. And uh, hopefully it, my nightmare doesn't come back where it's draining the battery and killing it. So I have to warranty it every time. So yeah, we're gonna pull the battery out and uh, uh, we'll go get it charged. Step two. Get your hand right. Alright, welcome back to the channel. Once again, we are working on this disco. It is about 135, 2.7 degrees out here. <sighs> So, I guess the goal is to try to get this box out of here so we can start working on it for this weekend. I'm trying to get it ready, get the fuck out of here, start camping, start living my best life. So, let's get this shit on the road. Friday before the major holiday 
and uh, I went and got some paint uh, this morning and we threw down the first coat check it out black coat and then we got some uh, bed liner that we found back over there somewhere so we are gonna use the bed liner uh, for the tops that way it's a nice uh, rough and tough surface that way we can throw shit on it guilt free guys we got uh, all the wood sanded now what we what I did is I uh, I test fitted it once again and uh, I marked an X on them that way we can um, bed line just this top part and then on the bottoms uh, <clears throat> we are going to uh, paint them uh, with exterior black paint so we're gonna do black uh, bed liner on top and then uh, We'll paint the the rest so she's coming along pretty good looking looking real good so uh hopefully tomorrow uh we can get uh, what do you call it all the wiring done uh, on the rover that way we can finally uh do the install uh, but there's still more stuff to do on it um i gotta figure out what i'm gonna do with um <clears throat> Uh, figure out what I'm gonna do with the diesel heater as far as the ducking goes, but that'll be tomorrow's challenges uh, Same thing with uh, the water tank. So tomorrow hopefully uh, I'll be able to pull all the interior out and uh, uh, Get the wiring going so uh, this is where we at. This is where we're at for today uh, Hopefully if I have any energy I could still uh, paint uh, paint the woods today so um so i gotta go pick up some more weed so uh, anyways all right guys we're back at it again we are now painting the panels painting them black and then we're gonna rhino line this beach guys it's done now I just gotta add uh, I'm just missing a couple little bolts a couple little knickknacks and uh, should be wrapping it up here soon so uh, next project that needs to get done is the wiring on it before I can put anything back because I don't want to do it again having to remove it and shit like that so uh, yeah so that's what we got for you guys today I think we're gonna end it here and uh yeah catch you on the next one peace